I play for the Charlotte Bobcats, or I used to play for the Charlotte Bobcats, before the NBA ruined my life. Tell me about the lockout. Um, I've been pretty depressed, eating a lot more. Um, that's about it. What exactly is happening between the owners and the players? Owners? Trying to crush my dreams, being an NBA superstar, because they're selfish. And they realize my talent level is unmatchable. So they'd rather fight for money than let me play. Have you seen a lot of your teammates lately? Uh, I keep trying to call them, but they won't return my calls. Don't know what that's about. Just want to get a little scrimmage going, maybe. They're not having it. I've been playing a lot of uh, World of Warcraft. Competitively, for money. When do you think the, the lockout's going to end? When the owners get their heads out of their asses. Or when they come to an agreeable compensation for both sides, one of the two. Which one are you predicting will happen first? Certainly not the heads out of the asses, I will tell you that much. Probably agreeable compensation for both sides. I got a job as a babysitter for my cousin and her 17 kids. She has 17 kids. Um, my NBA conditioning and athleticism really pays off from watching 17 kids. They're very quick, mobile, agile. I leave! Yeah. This is my cousin Eileen. She pays me eight fifty a dollar an hour to watch her uh, seventeen kids. Eileen, where are the Ninos at? They ran down the fire escape again. Down the damn fire escape. Can't can't control them kids. That's why you pay me eight fifty an hour. You're late. You feel qualified for that job? Yes. To qualify for any job, once you've been an NBA superstar, you can fly jet to the moon. Uncle Steve, I peed the bed again. I hate my life. Do you know how to perform CPR? No, but I know how to do a 360 dunk. I feel like those are pretty similar, right? Right. Right. Uncle Steve, I threw up my breakfast. How would a 360 dunk save a child? The, the, dude, their mind, their mind would explode with happiness. And that would save their life. That would save their life. The story of American journalism is an undergoing a dramatic rewrite. The pace of change makes many anxious and... Good night, honey. Uncle Steve! Yeah? Uncle Steve, I peed the bed again! Did you know that I'm... Even when I'm losing, I'm winning. Probably don't know what that means, but that's... The way I like to live my life. Eileen, I'm done for today. Thanks, Eileen. Good luck finding your ninos. <laughs>